Hello coolers and welcome back to Viva Barca, the home of everything Barca, where we are going to be discussing on some fresh updates. We are going to start with this report from reliable journalist Fabrizio Romano, talking about Cesar Aspelacueta as he claims that Barcelona have offered a two-year contract you know, to the Chelsea captain. We are going to be discussing much on that as we move ahead. Then secondly, talking about another transfer news, as FC Barcelona are interested in signing former Manchester City defender Angelino. We are going to be discussing much on that as well. So guys, as we get right into it, please make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Give this video a like and make sure to watch the video right up to the very end. Barca, Barca, Barca. Barcelona are believed to have already wrapped up the signing of Chelsea captain Cesar Aspilicueta on a pre-contract agreement over a Bolsman move in the summer. The Spanish international is in the final four months of his contract with Chelsea. While the Blues are trying to convince him to sign an extension, talks over a new deal have not progressed as per plans. Recent reports have claimed that Aspilicueta's transfer to Barca is all but done, something that former Chelsea and Barcelona midfielder Cech Fabregas also gave away in a recent interview. Now reputed transfer expert Fabrizio Romano has shed more light on the deal on his Here We Go podcast. According to the Italian journalist, Barcelona have offered Aspilicueta a two-year contract with an option to of extending the deal by another 12 months. The 32-year-old has been with Chelsea for nearly a decade and has won everything there is to be won in club level, most recently lifting the FIFA Club World Cup earlier this month. A versatile operator who can play anywhere across the back line, the Spanish international is being brought in by Barca to occupy the right-back slot, considering as Dani Alves will be out of contract at the end of the season, while Sergio Des is also staring at uncertain future. A player with so much experience, as Aspilicueta, along with his leadership skills, would add a lot of value for Barcelona even though you know, he would only be a short-term solution. Given his age, a two-year contract with an option to extend based on his performance and fitness seems a fair deal. Then on to the next story of discussion, Barcelona are set to prioritize the signing of a new left-back in the summer transfer window as they look to bring in cover and competition for Jordi Alba. The Spaniard has shown signs of age catching up with him recently and with no proper backup for him in the position, Barca tried to sign a new left-sided fullback in January but to no avail. As a result, a quality left-back will be on the agenda for Barcelona come summer, with Valencia captain Jose Gaia believed to be the top priority. However, with the Spaniard believed to be closing in on a new contract with Los Che, it would benefit Barca to keep their options open. Fischer Jets is now reporting that RB Leipzig left back Angelino has emerged as an option for Barcelona ahead of the summer. The 25 year old left Spain at a very young age to join Manchester City youth setup. The defender had loan spells away at New York City FC, Girona, Mallorca, and AC Breda before signing for PSV Eindhoven in 2018. After an impressive season in the Netherlands, he, has, he was signed back to Manchester City, but he failed to carve out a place for himself. Angelino joined Leipzig in January 2020, initially on loan, before his transfer was made permanent last year. The left back has flourished in Germany, tallying 10 goals and 23 assists in 82 matches to date, becoming a key player for the Bundesliga giants. However, in a recent interview, the former Manchester City star admitted to being keen on returning to Spain and playing in La Liga so as to stay close to his family. Barcelona could facilitate a move in the summer, but his market value stands at 30 million euros and his contract runs until 2025, which could put him beyond the Catalan's price range. So guys, with that, we have come to an end of this episode. Thanks a lot for watching. Hope you did enjoy the video and also hope you did subscribe. If you haven't, please make sure to do so, so you always stay up to date with the latest on FC Barcelona here on Viva Barca. Until next time. Bye-bye.